Yo, what up, blood? Welcome, welcome to the Thursday vlog, Unimoto Vlogs. Uh, been a while since I've vlogged. Uh, these flats behind me, they look very Soviet, don't they? Very Soviet looking. All right, once you go down here, there's no going back. Once we pass through that wall down there, there's no going back. So this is like some Berlin Wall shit, you know what I'm saying? So, right, so we're going to NPC territory. What better way to start a classic Thursday vlog by going through NPC territory? Here we go, you ready? You ready, guys? Ready? There we go, we're in. Mate, I've not even been in NPC territory a fucking minute, right? I've seen someone on the phone while they're driving. Classic NPC territory, classic Whitmore. You never fail to, to disappoint me, do you? Never fail, man. So, here we go. Look, look at all these NPCs, man. NPCs everywhere. Right, so there was a random blonde woman in a van. I'm not gonna say what, what, what van it was. I'm not gonna say what business it were because we, we don't do that on this channel. We don't name and shame on this channel. We don't do that, you know what I mean? But she was on a phone while she was driving, like, like looking down at the phone, looking up at the road, looking down at the phone, looking up at the road, looking down at the phone, looking up at the road, classic. Here's the famous iconic roundabout. You know it's out. Driving seat is on the side. Driving seat's on the other side. Got the, got the friendly nod there, right? As I was saying, I don't know if you guys could hear me, right? I was shouting a bit there, but it was very noisy, right? Basically, the driver's seat we all, was on the other side. Does that mean it's from another country? Or is it meant to be like that? Hmm, it's a mystery. Tractor, tractor, extractor fan. All right, so here we are, home of the spa, right? So just up the road is home of the Whopper, which is where we're going. Are you ready? Get the tractor in, get the tractor in, get the tractor in. Yes, we got the tractor in. Right, so this guy just walked past me and he looked like he, he were a footballer, like a famous footballer that plays for the spa rights. And I wanted to film him and ask him, but I didn't want to look like a dickhead, do you know what I mean? Like just sticking a camera into his face, be like, are you someone famous? Are you a footballer? You know what I mean? It's like. Yo, respect, motorhead, the motorhead, respect. Cigarette bud butts are rubbish, right? I'd like to do a quick segment on this. So I made a TikTok saying that I found it disgusting when people pick up used cigarette buds. And people in the comments were just admitting that they do it. Like digital footprint, like why would you admit that? You know what I mean? And then one person in the comments said, don't judge what you don't understand. Look, if I wanted it, if I had no cigarettes and I wanted a cigarette, I'd just ask someone politely. I wouldn't pick up like a used cigarette bud off the floor because that's dirty, that's disgusting. And, and then people moan about COVID and shit like that. And then, you know, you see, you see these people who pick up like these, these cigarette ends off the floor. Do you know what I mean? Why is everybody so stupid? Why can't people be more intelligent like me? So many NPCs, literally so many NPCs are out here. Like people just sitting in cars and not driving them. There's people just sat like in cars. Like what are you waiting for, man? It's a car, you're supposed to drive it. You again! Here we are, we're at BK, my favourite place on earth. We've got a chicken royale, so add some cheese onto that. You know what, I'm not gonna bother with bacon, I don't think. No mayo, no lettuce, let's get it. My favourite drink, Fanta. Chicken royale, tender crispy. You know, it's funny, I'm going to keep my Burger King crown on. I'm going to go to town in my Burger King crown. I like the attention. I like it when, you know what I mean? I like it when, I, I, I just like the attention. You know what I mean? <laughs> quick, quick, get on your X17 and fuck off, motherfucker. So obviously today is February 29th and for February 29th, I believe, only comes around every four years because it's a leap day and it's an official leap day. So I saw it on the Beatles story that they are like letting people in for free who are born on February 29th. You've got to show proof. Like I got excited and thought, wow, is it free entry? But you have to be born on February 29th. If only I was born a month later, eh? 
January 29th, well, it, they probably wouldn't have had February 29th in 2000. Then again, I am not sure. Was 2000 the leap year? I don't know. Hello. Look, have I ever mentioned that I really like these Pepsi cups? I really like them. They're proper like 80s, like retro. You know what's funny? Walking past KFC wearing a Burger King hat felt really awkward. Like, you know what I mean? Like thinking, who the fuck does this guy think he is? Walking past our KFC wearing a Burger King hat. 999, Juice World. Roses are red, violets are blue. Mate, I've just realised it's 1216. That means all the college youth will be coming out now. Oh dear. Oh dear. Oh no, I can't be arsed. Seriously, I can't be arsed. It's that man of TikTok. Hey, it's that man of TikTok. It's that f f famous geezer. Uh, it's TikTok man. Uh. Right, so I've trekked it all the way to the town centre from NPC territory. Yes, this is very doable. Yes, you can do this. You don't always have to get a bush, you know what I mean? Can't lie, I'm fucking knackered though. I wish I got the bus instead. I'm starting to think I probably should have got the bus because I'm knackered now. Obviously, the town centre is going to be very busy because it's a market day and it's lunchtime. So, this is like the, the rush hour, would you say? <laughs> reggae man. Yes, reggae man. It's the reggae man. I feel like I shouldn't be here. This feels really illegal. Spider Man! Hello. How are you doing? Good to meet you. <laughs> Cheers. So apparently, news being that this body shop is going to close, but it's actually not true. It's actually going to stay open. So this body shop is actually staying open. Don't believe everything you read. It's been decided to stay open. Remember, if you don't use it, you'll lose it. So use it. What is this bell? I want to know what this bell is. Where's it coming from and why does it not stop? Right, so you know if you look up here, right, you'll see Thanos Gauntlet from Infinity War. Fine, I'll do it myself. Now we've got the yards, so these are the yards, right? So these are the ends, fam, you get me? These are the yards, innit? You talk all road in the yards and that. When Clifford met Unimoto. I love you, Clifford. Clifford, everybody. Clifford, the big fuck off red dog. Right, guys, so this is how old I am. This is the Merca Slots place, right? Merca Slots. Right, I remember when this this used to be a BK. That's how old I am. I'm stood outside now with a Burger King crown on outside. What used to be Burger King feels somewhat ir ironic. Do you know what I mean? As you can see in the town centre, there's lots of empty shops. This being one of them. Let's have a little look, shall we? Oh, home invasion, pop smoke style. Hello. Oh, there's a clock there. A bando trolley, we've unlocked a new feature. New feature unlocked. There's an abando trolley. 50% off everything, so closing down. Which is kind of sad, isn't it? It's closing down, oh no. The question remains, does this mean I can get a Pepsi for 25p? Surely it does. Jesus Christ, look at the size of the queue, bro. Yo, mate, that, that, that is a long ass queue. I don't know if I can be bothered, you know. I think I'm gonna have to leave. I don't think I can be bothered. <laughs> nah. <laughs> Seen the size of the queue in there, I cannot wait in that. I'm not gonna wait in that queue. I don't have any patience to wait in long queues, I really don't. Something you need to know about me, I've got no patience whatsoever to stand in queues and wait. This is why I did not bother like going to Spudman. Do you know what I mean? I didn't bother queuing up in Tamworth to see Spudman because I just couldn't be bothered. Do you know what I mean? I didn't want to stand in that queue for like ages. So, yeah. The thing is, I still met Spudman because I saw him at closing time round the back and I just went and I, I saw him, I shook his hand or whatever. 
No, I gave him a fist bump actually. Yeah, that's what I did. Another Abando trolley. Another Abando trolley. How many Abando trolleys are we going to find in this vlog? So it, it wouldn't be a Chesterfield vlog if we didn't do Piss Alley. So here you go. Here's the famous Piss Alley where people go to piss. And yeah, you ready guys? We are going to be one of the Beatles. You ready? We're going to be one of the Beatles. Look at me, I'm John Lennon. I want to hold your hand. Oh look, it's another cameraman. Looks like I'm not the only one in the town centre. Lev would be very proud. Lev would be very proud. I don't know if you can hear it. Yo, so I'm in Poundland right now. I think I'll go for a Pepsi Max, shall I? <laughs> I remember this building right here, it used to be a co-op, a cooperative store. I remember buying a chocolate bar from here. I think I've probably spoken about that before, probably. But as you can see, there's a co-op bank, which is still open right next to it. But obviously the actual shop has shut down and it's been like this for years. Makes you think, what are they actually gonna do with it? So many empty like shops in town. It's kind of sad, you know, like all the em em empty places in the town center. Gasoline, American bar, very nice. Very, very nice. Nice place, nice pub. I got a little backstory, right? So, Gasoline, it used to be called County Music Bar back in the day, but obviously it changed in 2022. Right, and I remember that's where I did the gig, you know, the famous COVID song. That was where I was on stage in there and I was uh, singing that in there, so yeah. Nice memories, very good memories that we have in my town centre, in my hometown. <laughs> All right, time skip, time skip time. It's dark, we're back in NPC territory. I've literally just witnessed the stagecoach bus run a red light like right here. Literally just witnessed that shit. NPC territory never fails to disappoint. <laughs> 